Bang! Knives Knives, I'm Jared, and today we're going to go through a bunch of knives that are on sale right now. Some are not on sale, but I still think they're incredible purchases, but... There are a lot of things on sale right now because of Black Friday. Now, whether or not they're on sale or not, I still think they're great, great purchases. But some of these right now are really, like, they're really good value because they're, you know, discounted so much right now. Now, I did recently make a community post, and the link was not working very well. And that's for the F-22 Kickstop, the Jared Ozer. Um, lots of different variations of the Jared Ozer F-22 Kickstop. I have not tried it yet. I did purchase one, so I'm waiting for it. Now, I fixed the link. I know a lot of you guys tried to use the link, and it just was not working. I apologize. It has, it's not us. Something to do with the GP knives, and the, the link was just not working. So we did update it, and we're now using the Blade HQ link um, because... You know, some people it was working for and some people it wasn't. But it's replaced now and I'm going to link it in the, in the description at the top of the description for you guys. So you guys don't have to go search the community post if you want to check it out. Um, I'm waiting for mine and then I can give you some uh, further news on it. But I have a feeling it's going to be pretty good. Now, back to these. Urban EDC Supply, man. They have incredible stuff on their site. I'm going to link it. I have an affiliate link down in the description. Now, one thing in particular. Now, wait. There's a ton of things on their site. They have USA made stuff. They have pens. They have, you know, EDC gadgets and um, accessories. They have tons of stuff. But the F5.5, I think, is a knife that you really cannot go wrong with. I truly think that. I've tried many of them at this point and every single one of them has been so consistent i mean whether it was the titanium ones the micarta ones it doesn't matter and now there's a new version which is this blue micarta one it's almost like a dark gray but it looks really good and then it's got an etched blade now this one's sold out at the moment they're all sold out except for this one this one's the new one so but this one has the satin finish um well but you can see it gets pretty fingerprinty. Now, this one has the acid etch, which looks so good. You know, it um, just looks like it's been worn worn out, I guess you could say, but in a good way. But then when you get it in hand, you can't help but acknowledge how premium it is, how smooth it is, how crisp the detent is. You know, when you disengage it, how easy it is to get past the detent, and it's just glassy smooth whether you're using your thumb or the reverse flick both of them are equally as good right or left handed it's equally as good now the clip is not reversible so um, there's nothing i can do about that but it's got m390 steel titanium liners right this is titanium titanium liners titanium geared backspacer and a titanium deep carry clip i know the screws pop up but i have not had an issue yet with them or heard anybody that's had an issue with them it's a very comfortable knife in the hand i do feel the clip a little bit but it's not horrible but the knife overall is a tool no it's not going to be the pokiest thing in the world but for the primary uses you use an edc knife for on day-to-day um, for day-to-day -day needs, this is an exceptional knife. And like I said, the build quality is just, it's amazing. I do believe Riet is the OEM. So when you see the price, I think it's like 275 280 or something, something right around there, um, uh, under 300 bucks. It's, a, in my opinion, I think it's a pretty good value. I really do. Um, just because titanium liners, the fit and finish, the ergos, the consistency, which is super important because that's how I know if you guys ordered one, you're going to be feeling the exact same thing I do with this one. Um, because I have felt many of them and they've all felt the same. Next, let's get talk about this next thing. Now, the next thing is Hogue Knives. Hogue. Hogue's got some great deals right now. Um, I'm going to link it all down. Everything from this video will be linked in the description, even the things I talk about that I might not be able to show you. So they have the aluminum version of the Sig Sauer K320 for like 150 bucks. I think that's down from like 180 or something like that. The Hogue Deca in magnet gut steel is like $106 right now. $106. That's insane. 
Now, this one has the aftermarket original goat scales that you can get yourself that I also have a discount code for or any other scale that's on original goats website. They have spider coat scales, um, 8020 scales, 8025 scales. Um, I'm not sure how many DECA scales they have available yet, but they have lots of different patterns and yeah. <laughs> and talk about massively improving the knife. Oh, I can't express that enough. If you got some, some goat skills for your DECA, let me know down in the comments. I'd love to hear what you think. I think, man, this thing, it just changed the knife for me. I love it. And now I know some people will talk about the Magna Cut being a little bit on the softer side. Hoke's supposed to deal with that. However, for the price, I don't think you're getting a bad deal. I really don't. I think, you know, you're going to get decent edge retention. It's not going to be horrible. It's not like it's so soft that you're, you're not going to get your money's worth. It's just, yes, it could be a little bit harder. Now, the 6RK320, you guys probably already know how I feel about this. I love this knife. I do wish the whole deployment was a little bit bigger and a little bit better, but as a tool, as a knife, I mean, this thing is like job site ready. Now, this is the FRN version, but they do have the aluminum version. Like I said, that's usually a little bit more money, but right now it is for um, uh, an affordable price. But they do have a carbon fiber version. Sorry if you guys can hear anything in the background, but they have a new carbon fiber version with 20 CV. Now, that one, um, I'm probably not going to pick that one up myself. It is quite a bit more expensive, but it is available for those that love the K320. Let's talk about the next knife. Next, let's talk about the Kaisers. Kaiser has a bunch of great deals going on. The Cormorant, I believe, oh man, I can't remember, is going for like $152 right now. 20 CV, tight, full titanium, no steel liners, full titanium frag with a milled, <laughs> a milled and deep carry clip that also has a frag pattern on it and it works great i know it's on this frag pattern so you wouldn't think so but this thing because it doesn't have a ton of tension it works so good and this is like a fidget beast and then it has the some of the best acoustics very nice sound very fidgety very fun and then you have the titanium sheepdog now sheepdogs in general love the sheepdog awesome awesome knife but the titanium frame lock one boy does it feel premium the thickness of the scales the the softness of the lock bar when you disengage the pressure from the lock bar the detent and it has a solid detent and it just all together the clip you know the way the clip works everything feels extremely premium on this knife if you've ever felt a titanium sheepdog then you know what i'm talking about now they do have mini versions and regular flipper versions there's lots of different options with this there's also even more affordable options with liner lock my carter versions um 10v versions there's so many different versions um but some of them are on sale the the titanium frame lock one is on sale right now and also i think the titanium flipper one is on sale if you prefer a flipper rather than the whole deployment but i gotta say man this thing like i said it just you you really feel the quality with their titanium one so I, um, I do think that that's a great buy. Next, um, the Deviant, the Kaiser Deviant. This one, you guys know, I've been, I've been recommending this thing for since I got it. They have the tuxedo version, which is the black and white. I'm not sure if they're available or not. I think that might be the only one that's available. I'm not positive, but either way, this one's the copper and green micarta. I do like the tuxedo version. The tuxedo version is also very, very nice, but this has... Such a crisp and perfect detent for thumb stud action. It is so well tuned. And I've tried multiples and all of them have felt very, very similar. Super good detent. Good access to the lock bar. Very smooth on the drop. M390. It does have steel liners, but it's a great purchase. This is a great, great buy. I don't think you can go wrong with this one either. Not even just for the regular price. It's good, let alone when it's on sale. Hey, you're not subscribed to the channel, and I know that I have about a 70% chance of being right right now because of my analytics. So, please, subscribe to the channel if you like the content. Let's get back to the show.
Right now, it right now it's going for about $134 on the site, or right around. But that's while it's on sale, it will be going back up. So if you're watching this video later, I still think it's a good price for it with the regular price, but even a better price while they're on sale. Next, um, one more Kaiser really quick, actually. Um, the Kaiser Escort, $145, um, right around there. The price might go back up. I'm not 100% on that. It did start out at like 170, 180. Now it's like 145. I don't know if they're going to stick with that or not, but I got to say, I love this knife. I really, really do. This is a phenomenal work knife. I've been carrying the heck out of it. Like I need to, re I need to already sharpen it. Um, and that's not because the edge went bad fast. It's because I've been using the heck out of it. I really have. It's just the sound. I don't know if that'll I don't know if that'll come over the mic or not, but it has such a good sound. The Ergos 20 CV aluminum scales. It has their clutch lock system, so you can adjust the tension on the springs, and they also come with uh, stronger springs, so you can make it even stronger. The way it came, I haven't even switched this one because it came perfect, but I still have the ability to increase my detent if I want to, which is awesome. But yeah. I think this is a great purchase. I, I do. I think this is awesome. I did think before it was overpriced, but at 145, it, it's a lot more reasonable. Next, QSP. So this one in particular is traditional from traditional pocket knives, which I don't think they're running a sale on these. This is the jig bone pattern with titanium, um, but I still think it's an awesome buy. However, you can get the titanium frag version. The titanium, full titanium frame lock frag version with 154 cm with anodized titanium for like $109. You can get the re the regular flat titanium one for $96. $96. That's amazing. It's an amazing deal. Now, I don't think that that's like a sale or anything. I think that's just the way it goes. Like that's the price that they have for it for Blade HQ. So I will have that link down in the description. But you know, for the knife, the quality, the build quality, the fit, the finish, that is a phenomenal price. Um, now this one is a bit more because it's M390 titanium and it's a jig bone and it's an exclusive to traditional pocket knives. If you want to check these out, there's a bunch of great stuff on traditional pocket knives uh, website. Um, next, oh, really quick before we get out of here, I forgot to mention, Caviso has a bunch of different penguins, and lots of them. You can get Timascus ones. You can get the, the raw titanium one, an S35VN, and a Timascus clip for like a hundred, just under 140 bucks. But they have a ton of different options. If you go and you click on one of their penguins, you just scroll down and there's tons of different ones. There's, there's uh fat carbon fiber versions. There's mocha tie ones. There's, I mean, there's everything. I think it's a, a, like, a, it's under $300. Like I think it's uh, right, right around 270 for the Timascus, like the full Timascus scale. And tit it has raw titanium or purple titanium on this side and a Timascus club. So a lot of Timascus for about 270 um, now I know that's not on sale or anything like that, but I figured I would mention Caviso because they do have some sales on their site and we were talking about the penguin earlier and you can go on their site and there's lots of different options. I'm going to link a couple different places down in the description. So lots of different knife dealers that I will have linked down in the description. So you guys can check out, um, the M M a, sorry, the AM eight Morad. M390, full titanium, carbon fiber inlay, and it has amazing micro milling throughout the entire knife. The clip works good. It's not the deepest carry, but the clip works great. Access to the lock bar is good. You can come right, right from the side. Very smooth, crisp detent. Um, nice, comfortable flipper tab. Um, it is a little bit squared off on the edge, but it's a comfortable flipper tab. All you gotta do is light switch it. It's not much of a push button because just the, the way it is, you can do it like I just did, but it's not the most comfortable flip when you push button it. It 
likes a light switch. But good sharpening tool and plunge grind, and the ergos are very, very good. Now, it's a little bit more on the robust side, but that's what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be a little bit of a tougher knife. Nice, strong spine without being too thick. Nice, durable tip. It's a tip you could jam into things without breaking off. Yet, it's going to be slicey enough to do your day-to-day -day tasks, especially after you lower back the angle when you resharpen it. But for like a, it's under $200. So for what you're getting, it's actually under $180. So it's not a bad deal for what you're getting. You're getting a lot for your money with this one. Um, you know, especially with the build quality, the fit, the finish and all the good stuff. Yeah, this one is a good one. And it's a good looking knife. It kind of has a somewhat of a hinder look, I might say. Next Probably my favorite one on the list right now because I, they're going for such a phenomenal deal. The Kaiser, sorry, excuse me, the Concept Convict. One of my most recommended knives because for the $207, what it normally was, um, it I, I loved it, right? Now, for, now you can get, and you can't get this exact one, but you can get the blue one or um, another version, like a teal or something, for a hundred, for under one hundred and sixty dollars, just under one hundred and sixty dollars. The it has S thirty five VN. The titanium feels like really good quality. It has that very premium feel. The detent is perfection. Perfect sharpening tool. Now, I will say you want to get this version with the double thumb stud, not the one with the disc, but the clip works good. The reverse flick is amazing. I know some people are modding them like Backpack B. Shout out to Backpack B. Uh, go and subscribe to his channel. He's putting a whole deployment in his, which I think this thing deserves it. Um, very comfortable in the hand. Phenomenal blade shape for use. And as a pocket knife, as a tool, it's amazing. Then the fit, the finish, the ergos, the, the, the quality, the build quality is there. This thing is mega, mega smooth. But yeah, I, I don't think you can ever go wrong with this, especially for the price right now, like, like $50, $60 off. Now, I know this goes without saying, but the Civivi knife, Civivi has a bunch of great deals. They have the Civivi Riffle right now on sale for like 40 something dollars. You can get the mini Praxis for under $30. Amazing, amazing deals on Civivis right now. Even the Civivi Element to Button Lock is on sale. Normally, I think it was 65 You can get it for like 50 something So not the biggest sale, but it's such a good knife. I, I don't think you can go wrong with it for the price it, it is without the sale. So um, if you've been wanting a Civivi and you know want to save some money, now is the time. They have a lot of great sales. But the... If you're looking for something nice and big, a big, affordable folding knife, the Migoran Valona 14C 28 end steel, phenomenal reverse flicking action. They also have they have other knives as well that are really clean and really good, but this one is like fifty dollars, like right right at right around fifty bucks. Um, phenomenal action, really good, smooth action. Um, Great reverse flick, super solid, good access to the lock bar, nice coating, and has a nice look to it too. Simple, but good. Um, beautiful pivot collar, titanium pocket clip, like I said, 14C, steel liners, G10 scales, awesome, awesome knife, awesome, awesome value. But anyways, there you guys go. I wanted to show you guys some great deals that are happening right now on or for some great knives that are already great before the, the discount. Some of which don't have any discounts, but are still great knives. I love you guys, and I appreciate you guys watching. Please hit the like bell. Like bell? Like button if you like the content. I love you guys. Peace.